Hello friends, in this video, we will learn how to effectively use Zoom with software to enhance our presentation every time. Have you ever wondered, during the presentation or when we are making YouTube videos, it is crucial to emphasize specific points and highlights particular areas. This ensures that our audience can better understand the concepts we are explaining. Why to use Zoom it? Zoom it allows you to draw, highlight, emphasize specific points on your slides. The tool enables you to zoom in specific areas of your screen. Zoom provides pen and highlighted tools that can be used to underline, circle, emphasis important information on your slides. It's a lightweight and user-friendly tool. Unique features of Zoomit. We might indicate something using an arrow like this. Zoom in on screen like this. To draw a rectangle to highlight a certain area in presentation like this. So this video demonstrates simple Zoomit software. It helps you to make effective presentation. Now we will see how to download the Zoomit software. Go to Google search engine, type Zoomit. Select this first link. So here it shows Zoomit version 7.2. So you have to select this area, download Zoom it. When you select this, the Zoom it software will get downloaded. We already downloaded the Zoom it software. You will unzip it, you will get a folder like this. So go inside and click Zoom it application. We see it here, the little box opens up. This has all the instruction operating with the Zoomit software. So we are having a Zoom tab. It explains you how to use Zoom, the draw tab. How to draw any shapes like rectangle, round, ellipse and an arrow. Type tab. It shows how to type on your screen. So. The Zoomit is having various features. For the sake of simplicity, I have listed all the features in a Microsoft Word document. Fundamental features of Zoomit software. To begin, Zoom mode plus Control plus 1. Then using mouse wheel, you can zoom in and zoom out. To exit from the Zoom mode, use the Escape key or the right mouse button. Now I am pressing Control 1. Zoom mode. I am performing zoom in and zoom out by using the mouse wheel. To exit from the zoom mode, press escape key or right mouse button. So now I press the escape key and out of this zoom mode. Next, feature 2. For drawing mode, first we should be in zoom mode. Press Control 1. Now I am in the Zoom mode. To begin drawing mode, press the mouse's left button. I am pressing the mouse's left button. My cursor appears as a dot symbol. Press spacebar to align cursor at center. I am placing the cursor at top right corner and pressing the spacebar, it comes to the center. Again, I am placing the cursor in bottom left corner and pressing the space bar, it comes to the center. Next, to draw a straight line, press shift and left mouse button. If you drag it, you will get a straight line. I am changing the color and drawing a straight line again. To erase the drawing, press E. The drawing get erased. To draw a rectangle, press Ctrl and left mouse button. So this is the rectangle. To draw an ellipse, press 
tab and left mouse button tab left mouse button and drag it you will get an ellipse i'm changing to green color and drawing an ellipse again to draw an arrow press shift control and left mouse button so i drag it i'm getting an arrow so i can get both the right and left top and bottom arrows to increase and decrease is the line and cursor size in a drawing mode press control and mouse scroll up and down or you can use up arrow or down arrow now i am drawing a line i want to increase the size so control and i am now pressing the up scroll so see how it is increased now it is a rectangle i am drawing a line again straight line see the difference to downsize it you can control and you can press the down arrow now the size will get decreased similarly i am changing the color to blue now i am using the up arrow control and up arrow size increases now i am drawing an ellipse i am changing the color to red decrease the size with the help of the down arrow control and down arrow now the size got decreased again i am drawing an ellipse now see the thickness got reduced next feature colors and highlight so first use the colors and highlight you should be in zoom in mode press control 1 now I am in zoom in mode. My cursor is in red color. To change it to blue, you have to press B. Now the cursor is in blue. To change it to green, press G. Now it is in green color. I am able to draw the green color. To change it to yellow, press Y. It is yellow color. To change it to red, press R. So it is red color. Change it to orange, press O. So it is orange color and so on. You are able to change the color. If you draw any symbols, it will be in appropriate color. Okay, which you choose. For example, I am changing it to red. I am pressing R. I am changing a ellipse. So these are the colors. To erase the symbol, press E. Now, we are going to discuss about the highlighter. Highlighter, only highlight. So, I will just show you how the highlighter works. So, for highlighter, press shift and appropriate color button which is discussed. Now, I am going to change the highlighter as a blue color. Shift plus B. If I draw a line, highlighter won't hide the text. I am changing to normal uh, color. So, if I draw over it, it will hide the text. This is the difference between the highlighter and the normal color pen. So, I am going to change. Highlighter green, shift G. Now this is highlighter green. I am going to change it as a highlighter red, shift R. Highlighter red. Now I am going to change it to highlighter yellow, shift Y. This is highlighter yellow, orange, shift O. Highlighter orange. So in this way, we are able to use the highlighter and colors. Next feature 4. Start drawing while not in zoom mode. So far, we use zoom mode. You have to press control 1. But I don't want zoom mode, but I want to write and perform all the activities like drawing symbol and everything. So, for this, you have to press control 2. It won't be in zoom mode, but you will do all the works regularly. For example, I can draw symbols, I can change color. So, I am drawing line. I can do all the activities without zoom mode. For this, you have to press Ctrl 2. To remove the previous entry, you have to press Ctrl Z. 
the previous entry alone removed. For example, I am having here two symbols. One is the rectangle in red color. Another one is blue arrow symbol. So I want to remove the entry which is made recently. That is the arrow symbol. For this, you have to press Ctrl Z. The symbol will be removed. So I am drawing uh, some other symbols. I'm drawing ellipse. I'm drawing a another rectangle. So these are all the symbols. Now I want to erase all these symbols. We have to press E. If you give E, all the symbol will be erased. For example, if I press Ctrl Z, only the recent entry will be erased. I am pressing Ctrl Z now. The recent entry, this rectangle is vanished. I want to remove all the my drawing in a stitch. You have to press E. Everything will be removed. The escape from this mode, drawing mode, you have to press escape key or right mouse button. Next, text mode. So I am going to normal mode for drawing that is control 2. I am able to type a text here. You have to type a text, press the button T. Now it is ready for text. So I am typing some text. To increase or decrease the font size in this typing mode, press Ctrl, mouse scroll up to increase the size. Or mouse scroll down to decrease the size. Now I am increasing the size. I am performing Ctrl plus mouse scroll up. Now I am typing a text. To decrease, press Ctrl, mouse scroll down. Now the size got decreased. Similarly, we can use the up arrow and down arrow keys. So, press the control button and if you use the up arrow key, the size will be increased. Down arrow key, the size will be decreased. I am pressing the up arrow key, the size is increased now. So, this is a letter. To decrease it, you can press control and the down arrow button. To exit the text mode, press escape button or the right mouse button. Now I am pressing the escape key. I am exit from the text mode. Next feature 6. Whiteboard and blackboard. Whiteboard drawing mode. For a completely white background, enter drawing mode. You can press control 1 for a drawing mode with zoom in. Control 2 for a drawing mode without zoom in. And press the left mouse button and press E W. I am pressing Control 2 and I am pressing the left mouse button and key W. So this is my whiteboard. I can write whatever I want. I am able to change the color. I am drawing a rectangle. To exit from this whiteboard, you have to press the escape key or right mouse button. I am pressing the escape key. Blackboard drawing mode for a completely black background. Enter drawing mode plus press left mouse button and press key key. So I am entering the drawing mode and pressing left mouse button and pressing the key key. Now this is a blackboard. So this is my blackboard. To exit from the blackboard, you have to press the escape key or the right mouse button. Next, to exit, which I demonstrated, you have to press the escape key or the right mouse button. To copy the screenshot of zoom the screen, first you have to enter the zoom mode. So I am pressing Ctrl plus C. Now the zoomed screen got copied in a clipboard. I am coming out. I am opening the word file. I am pasting this. Now the copied zoomed screen got pasted. I can save it. Now I am not saving it. To save the zoomed screen directly. Press Ctrl S. Yes. A window 
will open to save your file. You have to give a suitable name and select save. Next feature 7 countdown timer. To show the countdown timer, press Ctrl 3. To increase the time, mouse scroll up or up arrow keys to be used. To decrease the time, press mouse scroll down or down arrow keys. To exit, press the escape key or right mouse button that will exit you from the timer. I am pressing Ctrl 3. Now the timer starts. To increase the timer, I am using up arrow button. I am able to increase the timer. To decrease the timer, I am using down arrow key. The timer got decreased. To exit from the timer, I am pressing escape key. In this video tutorial, the various features of the zoom in software is demonstrated. I am going to upload a video soon with some additional features. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel, share, comment and press the bell button. Thank you.